Hi, good morning everyone, it's Julie Kay. I've been a hairdresser for over 40 years, so I wanted to show you a couple things that I've learned. And I've been helping my clients with some wigs because everyone has been having hair loss lately. So this is a wig that my friend Debbie bought. And uh, I do her hair extensions, and I kind of have to do them in phases where I take them out, color her hair, and put them back in. So she bought this wig so that she could wear while her hair extensions are out. And she got so many compliments on it that um, we, we couldn't believe we only paid $10 for it on Timu. So this is an ombre color. And she wore it for about a month. So I just shampooed it and conditioned it with the new product that we have by Milkshake. And this is Milkshake Instalite strengthening shampoo with a filler effect. So what this does is it's gonna fill in the dry, damaged hair and prepare it for the condition treatment. And it has a instant conditioner that takes 60 seconds, but it's equivalent to a 30 minute deep conditioner. And it makes your hair super shiny like glass. And then it has step three that you put in the hair and it's a leave-in. And when you flat iron the hair, it makes your hair look like glass. And so this is a milkshake. Milkshake is by, uh, from Italy, and it's made out of natural products. This product is made out of lemon and blueberries, and it smells kind of like peaches. So it's a professional only treatment from your salon that gives your hair a mirror effect. So I just use this on her wig to bring back the life of it, because after wearing it for a month, it looked really shattered. Okay, so I'm gonna try this on for you so you can see what it looks like. Okay, I'm gonna use a plastic cap so that it's sanitary. <laughs> Plus I left the wig caps at the salon and I'm at home this morning before work. Okay, so here is the ombre. This might've been $12, but I've seen it on sale for 10. So it has um, bangs, and you could cut those in a curtain bang if you wanted to. The bangs come really long because everybody's forehead is a different length. So depending on where you set it, you might want to wear these forward, or you might want to part them. Now remember, when you buy a synthetic wig, you cannot change the color. So you need to buy it the color that you want. I would say this is kind of an ash blonde and she gets lots of compliments when she wears this. So this is the ombre. I'll try and put up the picture so you guys can see it. Okay, I have another wig. That I bought for one of my customers and it's a, it's a granny color. <laughs> so I don't like myself in short hair, but I'm gonna do this for you guys. <laughs> So most of these wigs have to be cut on the client so that you can adjust the bangs and the back. Some people like the wispy back. Some people want it cut up. Sometimes the wigs are really big and they need thinned. This one kind of has long bangs. Cute over the sides. The color's cute. So this is what I'll look like in a couple years. <laughs> Okay, okay, I bought another wig for one of my clients and she didn't like it, so she gave it to me. This wig I have not shampooed with the milkshake, but I, I will, and I'm gonna cut it either with some bangs or you might have to wear a headband with it because um, I just don't like the spot right here. So I'm gonna show this for you guys. All these wigs have a band in the back that you can make them tighter if you have a smaller head. It has a full top, and then it's kind of airy through the sides. But all these wigs were $10. So I'm 
Okay, so once I shampoo this with my milkshake, Instalite shampoo, treatment conditioner, and leave-in treatment, it's gonna make it look better. And then I am gonna cut this to make it look more real. And I, like I said, I might cut in bangs, but the color was pretty. It was a medium copper blonde with some kind of caramel highlights. And you could wear this maybe to the side and cut bangs in too, which I, I kind of did the bangs like that. But uh, this will look better when I, when I have time to work with it. Okay, and then those are the three wigs. Now I have two hair toppers I want to show you guys. And hair toppers are for people that can't wear hair extensions through the sides and they're thin all in the top. So when I was trying to buy these on Timu, everything was in centimeters, and it's been a long time since I went to school, so I had to convert the centimeters to inches. So it took me forever. But this one came up and it was a large um, area. I think it's a six and a half by six and a half. So it has full bangs, it has a natural scalp, and this is an 18 inch, and this is a light golden brown. And it feels absolutely beautiful. And I got this for $10. So this is just a, a hair topper. It goes just on the top of your hair so it's not as hot. And these come in about um, maybe six or eight colors. And these have the little snaps in them, little hair extension snaps. So you're just gonna slide them in on your hair and clip it in. And I bought this for a particular client of mine who is on about her fourth or fifth hair topper. And she paid $400 at a wig shop for a um, synthetic hair topper. So $10 is a steal on this if you can find your color. Because remember, synthetic hair, you have to buy the color that you want. Now, if you like these and you want to um, get a human hair topper, they're not that expensive either on Timu. Okay, so this would go like this. And it's kind of hard for me to see exactly where the bangs are at. Okay, so this is an 18 inch hair topper and it has the curtain bangs, it has the natural scalp and it's a wide area. So it's gonna cover any bald spots that you have back here. And I could probably even wear this um, because it's, yeah, it's probably too thin. But anyway, this could be cut to your length and it could be layered. So $10 is a steal. <laughs> okay, and then the last one I got was only $5, but it's a smaller piece. So this would be for somebody that had a smaller head or a smaller bald area. Now, to curl synthetic hair, you could roll it on rollers and let it sit overnight, but it's better just to buy a, a curly or a waved one. But this one has bangs, and this is about my color. So I have somebody in mind for this, but she'll want it um, curled. So I gotta work with it a little bit more. I did shampoo it with the Milkshake Shampoo treatment and leave-in conditioner. This is kind of cute. Like if I can get this fixed and I don't feel like doing my hair, I can just stick this on top of my hair that day. So anyway, that's my um, three wig review and two toppers. So thanks for watching. It's hot, hot, hot here. 104 hundreds the next 10 days. So we're gonna try and stay cool and I appreciate all 55 of my subscribers. <laughs> Love you guys. Have a good day. Bye.